Hello everyone. In this video session, I am going to explain part 153 of Java for tester series. That is types of inheritance. In the previous video, I have already explained what is meant by inheritance and how to use inheritance in Java programs. The current video session, I am going to explain the different types of inheritance we have in Java. So there are different types of inheritance we have in Java, guys. They are single inheritance, multiple inheritance, multi-level inheritance, hierarchical inheritance, and hybrid inheritance. These are the different types of inheritance we have in Java, guys. So let me show you what exactly these different types of inheritance mean, OK? These are the different types of inheritance we have in Java, guys. Let me show you how the different types of inheritance will work in Java, OK? Let's start with the first type of inheritance, that is single inheritance. Single inheritance. So I will show you how the single inheritance works in a diagrammatic way for now, OK? In the upcoming videos, I will practically demonstrate. For now, in this current video, I will show you how the single inheritance can be represented in a diagrammatic format so that you can understand. So this is a class and this is another class, OK? Class A and class B, OK? Class A, class B. And here, class B is extending class A, let's say, OK? Class B is inheriting class A. This is known as single inheritance, guys. Okay. In single inheritance, one class will extend another class. Okay. This is known as single inheritance. Is this possible, guys? In Java, can we write a program where we can create these two classes where one class is inheriting another class? Is it possible? Yes. As explained in the previous video, this is possible, guys. Okay. A class extending another class or a class inheriting another class is possible. Okay. So this is the first one. Now, we have other types of inheritance, that is multiple inheritance. Multiple inheritance, OK? So what is multiple inheritance? So in multiple inheritance, it is diagrammatically will look like this, guys. Multiple inheritance in a diagrammatic format will look something like this, OK? So let's say this is class A, and this is class B. And this is class C. Here, class C is extending or inheriting both class A and class B. The same class is inheriting two classes. Class is inheriting or extending two classes, guys. Is it possible? No, guys, it's not possible in Java. Okay, you cannot write programs where you can have a class inheriting okay the same class inheriting multiple classes is not possible single class inheriting multiple classes or is not possible in java guys okay what will happen guys when you try to do so when you say class c extends class a comma class b that is not possible in java because it gives and it gives compiler error guys okay only single class can extend another class guys okay a class can extend only one class but here class is trying to extend from two classes so class is not only trying to inherit the properties of class a but say at same time class is also trying to inherit the properties of the class b which is not possible in java guys if you try to do so you will get compiler error okay it's not possible in java the next one is multi level inheritance multi level inheritance okay how does it look multi level inheritance as the name suggests different levels okay level 1 level 2 level 3 like that okay okay here let's say this is class a 
diagrammatically the multi level inheritance will look like this guys okay class a class b and class c here class b is extending class a class b is one class which is extending only one class that is possible here class c is extending class b here class is one class which is extending only one class that is also possible so this kind of levels is possible guys okay you, you can have a multi level inheritance possible in java case where class c is extending class b and that class b is extending another class okay class c inheriting class b class b inheriting another class class a okay this is possible in java case fine the next one okay we are done with the multi level inheritance representation here and uh, the next one is we'll go with the hierarchical okay hierarchical inheritance hierarchical inheritance in hierarchical inheritance the diagrammatically if i have to represent the hierarchical inheritance it will look something like this guys okay let's say this is class a this is class b then we have class c and then class b here class b is extending class a okay class b is inheriting the properties of the class a this is possible and also class c is also inheriting the properties of the same class a this is also possible okay only one class only from one class this class a is inheriting so it's possible and only from one class only from a single class this class g is inheriting so this is also possible so in hierarchical inheritance multiple classes inherit from the same class which is possible in java guys okay which is possible in java because each and every class is only inheriting from a single class that's why it's possible okay class b only one class class a class c is also inheriting only from one class that is class a class d is also inheriting only from one class that is class a so it is possible guys and uh, finally we have finally we have hybrid inheritance guys okay finally we have hybrid inheritance let me explain the hybrid inheritance first okay hybrid inheritance type okay the last type of inheritance is hybrid inheritance guys in java so how does it look diagrammatically it looks something like this it's a combination of single inheritance and uh, it's a combination of uh, what you call hierarchical inheritance and uh, multiple inheritance okay it's a combination of this hierarchical inheritance and multiple inheritance so let me show you what will happen so before i draw these lines i will say this is class a this is class b this is class c and this is class d okay here class b is inheriting class a and class c is also inheriting from a single class that is class a this is possible because up to here is a hierarchical inheritance guys multiple classes inheriting only from single class which is possible okay but here on the downside other part that is a lower part of this hybrid inheritance where this class d will extend both classes known as okay class d will extend the properties from both classes known as class b and class c so this lower part will fall into this uh, multiple inheritance which is not possible guys upper part is possible but lower part where single class inheriting multiple classes is not possible in java okay this also will result in compiler error okay it's not possible in java guys hybrid inheritance is not possible in java not possible okay like this guys there are different types of inheritance in java guys few inheritance are possible few inheritance types are not possible coming to single inheritance it is possible then we have multiple inheritance which is not possible okay multi level inheritance which is possible hierarchical inheritance which is possible and hybrid inheritance is not possible like that there are different types of inheritance and all those 
these are the five different types and uh, they look diagrammatically like this okay they look diagrammatically like this guys so guys this is all about the different types of inheritance okay this is all about the different types of inheritance and in the next video session i'll practically demonstrate the first type of inheritance that is single inheritance okay i'll explain the first type of inheritance known as single inheritance and in the other other types of inheritance will be explained in the upcoming videos okay i will start with single inheritance followed by other types of inheritance in the upcoming videos so so that's it guys see you in the next video session thank you bye